Hello and welcome back to educator.com and welcome back to AP Calculus. So today we're going to talk about the technique called integration by parts. Let's jump right on in. So let's recall the power rule, um, I'm sorry, the product rule from uh, differential calculus. Make sure we're in black here. Yes, okay, so we have the product rule. Product rule for differentiation says f times g prime is equal to f prime g plus f g prime. Now, if I integrate both sides, um, I can retain the equality. So integrating both sides, retains the equality, as we know. Anything we do to one side, as long as we do it to the other, everything is fine. So we've got the integral of fg prime equals the integral of f prime g plus f g prime. Well, the integral of the derivative just goes away, so that just becomes fg is equal to, and the integral operator is linear, so I can essentially distribute it out, so it becomes the integral of f prime g plus the integral of f g prime. Now I'm going to rearrange to get the following. I get the integral of f g prime is equal to f g minus the integral of f prime g. So this is our formula for something called integration by parts. And again, don't worry, we're going to actually explain this. Much of this actually makes sense once you actually see some examples. Okay, in differential notation, we're, it's going to look like this. And that's how we're actually going to be using it. So in differential notation, u is our function of x, v is going to be our I'm actually going to arrange it this way. u is going to be our f of x, and it'll make sense why I'm arranging this in, in um, our v is going to equal our g of x, our dv Sorry, it's going to be g, wait a minute, now I'm lost. Yes, dv is equal to g prime of x. You know what, never mind. <laughs> Let's just stick to what we've got. u is our f of x, v is our g of x, du is our f prime of x, and dv is our g prime of x, based on what we just wrote in the previous uh, thing. So with that notation, what we have is the following. We have the integral of u dv, u dv, f of x g prime, f g prime, is equal to uv f g minus the integral of v du g f prime. So this is the way we're actually going to use the integration by parts. Now, if we have an integrand, so if we are faced with an integrand, which is a product which is a product of two functions, And we can express u dv, in other words, this product. There's, if we can express u dv as 
some function one times some function two, then we can solve the integral by using the right side of the equality. The right side of the equality. And again, examples will make this clear. Don't worry if you didn't understand anything that I just wrote symbolically. Examples are going to make this just immediately clear. So let's jump on right up.